Hey guys, in this video you're going to see us do a quick and dirty refresh of this new to us hog feeder. As you can see, the wood has outlived its usefulness, so we're going to replace some wood, give it a little bit of a spray job, and get it ready for the hog pen in the summer. Luckily for us, it came to us with no missing parts, so it should be quite easy. When we purchased this, we were assured that the bottom was not rusty and that it was stable. Thankfully, that was true. What we looked for most was to make sure that all of the lids were there because they are extremely hard to find. This is one of four that we purchased in 2023 and we're going to refresh for the 2024 season. It does have the best bottom and also came with all of the flip lids. The other ones we will have to purchase some flip lids for, um, and we found those online at Sioux Steel Company out of Sioux Falls, South Dakota. After grinding off the old hardware and a little bit of surface rust, it was ready for a thin coat of paint before we put on the new wood. I wasn't able to show the wood installation process, but it was quite straightforward and easy. It did require two people. Looking on to the inside of the feeder, it's pretty clean. I just needed to do a quick shop vac and repair a little bit of surface rust on the inside and we were ready to load her up and head out to the pig pen with her. Against the beautiful Montana sky, it looks amazing and it's ready for use in the 2024 season. You will notice on the one side there's a red dot on one of the flap lids. We put that there because directly below it is a tug um, to hook onto and pull out and we wanted to be able to identify where that was in case it got buried into the mud or dirt after use. Guys, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my channel. There will be probably more of this coming as we get parts and I appreciate you being here. Have a great day.